All right, let's take a look at where Manchester City has gone wrong this season. Let's get right into it. So first off, let's take a look at Manchester City's previous two seasons. So looking at the two seasons, uh, goals conceded is quite low. Shots on target conceded is very low as well. And nearly 40 clean sheets in two seasons, which is absolutely ridiculous. Now looking at this season, you look 31 goals conceded, that's pretty low as well. 90 shots on target conceded, that's quite low. And also 10 clean sheets, which is, you know, that's not bad. Considering that there's still some games to play this season. So, look at the stats. There's really not much of a discrepancy between this season and their two title winning seasons. Um, so, the only real difference is that there really is none looking at the stats. Meaning that there's another problem with Manchester City this season. Um, you know, I, I've noticed this is probably the main reason, and the thing that I've noticed with Manchester City is that teams aren't just more clinical. Manchester City are a lot slower than they have been in their previous two seasons. Um, they're not moving the ball as well. You know, they're giving up possession a lot. Um, just really, really sloppy. Um, and the thing with Manchester City is they their game is built on possession. So they're always pushed up really, really high up into the opponent's half of the field. So whenever they make a mistake or somehow the opponent gets possession, they're so exposed at the back that teams really exploit that and they make sure they take their chances when they go forward. Um, so yeah, that's probably like the only real reason why Manchester City have done so badly this season. But I'm only certain that they're going to be back. Uh, fighting for the title next season. So yeah, uh, that's about it.